Hello, my sweet, sweet little coconuts. Uh, we've had a patch update. It's PK here, just in case you didn't know. Now you do. We had a 915 patch update, which gave us um, an update to pets, which is pretty cool. And then we'll also talk in this video about some of the events that are currently running. Uh, but th well, let's zone in on these pets. It's uh, been a long time coming, I feel. They've given them an enhancement upgrade. Immortal pets can now go to plus 20. Uh, cool thing is some of these plus 20s will deploy a larger size than what we're used to seeing. So that's going to be uh, your Satyr, your Ifrit, Living Armor, Cockatrice, Cerberus, Magmaron, and Death Knight. It's going to take about 30 of these pets to go from plus 15 to plus 20. So we can hop into that codex there and take a look at these. A lot of the stats on these are going to be doubled from what you're used to seeing at plus 15. So if we take a look at the plus 20... His troop attack went from 240 to 480, and we see a lot of these stats are doubled. Um, same thing when you're looking at the turtle here. If you look at the plus 15 stat of 120, it goes to 240. So his stats are doubled. Some are close to being doubled, like the um, Thunder Phoenix at plus 15. He's 500. At plus 20, he's 950. So... I don't know, that's what, somewhere around 95%, 90-95% increase. Um, and some of these are not like, uh, what was the one I was looking at earlier? I think it was the snail. No, his was doubled. I don't know who else I was looking at, but some of them were doubled, some of them were not doubled. But most of them were pretty close to being doubled. So that's just a general rule of thumb for these. And we also got two new pets, which are the giant ant, which uh, I wasn't too impressed with when I looked at his name, just by the name, uh, not, not the increase it gives, but just by the name. Um, but when you look at him, he actually does look pretty cool for an insect. I mean, I really like the way his chest flows. He's going to focus on your construction. Um, he's going to start out at 250%, and if you get him to plus 20, he'll give you a 1,500% bonus to your construction. And then there's also um, decreased construction time as you go. And then we have the bear wolf, part bear, part wolf. And he's going to focus on your research and basically does the same thing. Starts off at 250. If you get him to plus 20, he's going to go to 1500%. And then you also get a uh, decrease to your days of speed as you enhance. Definitely will help with a lot of that uh, research. Incredible time that we spend on research. I do have uh, some scrolls that we can look through. We'll summon 500 here and see what I get. Because you can get these new pets in the uh, grade 6 summoning scrolls, 5 through 6 and 4 through 6. Uh, you can also get him in a treasure from another world event that's currently running too. It's not too bad, I guess. I do have some specific grade scrolls we can look through, see if I get lucky in any of these. So I did get a bear wolf, but I get, it's because I complained about the giant ant's name, isn't it? Ah, well. And uh, like I said, it's going to take about 30 of those pets to enhance. I do have some satyrs ready to go. And hunts and hunts and yeah it's gonna take 30 of them and there he goes and I will I will do the rest later So aside from all those good pet things, 
We also have Dark Moon coming up, so make sure you register your alliance. You'll be able to get 100,000 signets by doing so. We have a treasure from the Nether World event currently going on. It's a great way to get basically um, anything. <laughs> you get Divine Stone, pets, resources, sulfur, gear, boost, house powers, hero lord, XP, VIP speeds, hero tokens, and all that jazz. Uh, you can get keys from PAX, Infernos, and DM Point Achievement tiers, so make sure you're doing that in your Dark Moon. As you can see here, I am actually super short on iron, so I am trying to get pretty much any iron and sulfur that I can with these. And don't forget to check your mail to get a free key expansion. There's also a random card event that's currently going. You'll be able to do refresh it 10 times. You can get blood moon coins, as you're seeing in here, uh, sulfur orbs, all sorts of fun things. You can also get these chests. I got some earlier so we could take a look at these. I think they're abundance chests. Yeah, yeah, here they are. And this is all the stuffs that you can get in here. You can also do that actually in a treasure from another world if you want to see what you can get. But there's a chance to get gold. We'll just open the 10 that I got and uh, see what happens. So I got some VIP resources, some grade 6 scrolls. And with the treasure from another world, if you click on this little eye, it's going to show you everything you could possibly get, the rate or chance of getting it, and the cost. So that's my short and sweet video for today. I hope you guys are doing awesome. I hope to see you in Dark Moon. I'll probably be under a different name because that's just, I'm shy and that's how I roll. But if you find me, say hi and uh, like, subscribe. Check out our website at www.ironthroneelite.com. And until next time.